too bright? Yeah, it's too bright. I need to turn it down. Hey! So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you my Netflix favorites. So summer vacation has started for most people. Netflix is a very big part of summer. And yeah, I have quite a lot Netflix of I have quite a lot of Netflix favorites. Like, I have a lot of shows. I watch a lot of shows on here. I'm not finished with it. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you watch any of these shows. And comment down below shows that you could recommend to me. Because I'm honestly, I really, really, really like want to watch more. And make sure to subscribe because um, I'm going to post twice a week now for summer vacation since I have a lot of time on my hands and I'm not doing anything because I don't have a life. Let's go into the video. Drop top Porsche, rolling on my wrist, diamonds up and down my chain. I'm going to do it in order from like ones that I really really like to the order that's like just so at the very very top is Stranger Things. Stranger Things is the best freaking show I have ever watched in my entire life. If you like like the Goonies and E.T. and all of those like 80s movies and you would like um, Stranger Things, kid named Will who goes missing, I'm not going to tell you uh, what happens or, or how he goes missing, but he goes missing. His three other friends try to find him and look for him and along the way they meet this girl and her name is Eleven. You'll understand why her name is Olivia. Yeah, she has like weird superpowers or something. There's two seasons. My second favorite show is Vampire Diaries. I'm freaking obsessed with that show. I'm on the second season, barely. So it's about this teenage girl named Elena. And she's like going to high school or whatever. It's this guy named Stefan and he's a vampire. And he has a brother named Damon. And it's just like a lot of vampire stuff. And, uh, yeah, it's a really good show. I recommend. 13 Reasons Why. So 13 Reasons Why has two seasons. Um, the second season just came out not too long ago. And 13 Reasons Why is about a sophomore girl who commits suicide and she leaves behind a box of tapes explaining why she killed herself. If you watch 13 Reasons Why, you're gonna cry. Um, I cried several times. It's really deep, so you're not gonna go into it like- Oh hey, like open mind. Like you can go into it with an open mind. But by the time you're on like the fifth episode, it's like really deep. The next show is Jane the Virgin. Jane the Virgin is such a freaking good show! Oh my god! Jane the Virgin is about a... I don't know, I don't know how old she is, like late 20s, early 30s. Gets pregnant, and I'm not going to uh, give away how she gets pregnant, but she gets pregnant and it's not by <clears throat> intercourse. It's like she's a virgin. Obviously, it's called Jane the Virgin, so. The show is Riverdale. I barely started the second season, and Riverdale is about, like, a town. Uh, the first season is about who killed Jason Blossom, which is, um, Cheryl Blossom's brother. I don't really know how to explain it. Like, I'm so bad at explaining things. But I really like that show. It's a really, really, really good show. So, highly, highly recommend it. These are unfortunate events. They, um, there was a movie, but it's actually a TV show. Um, there's two seasons. I haven't started the second season yet, but the first season is really good. It's just about these three orphans who um, can't find a like place to live. Like they, um, they're orphans, like they don't have parents, so they keep like tossing around two different um, places like for, uh, for, for them to live. And they come across this guy who's like super weird and like really just strange. And they don't they don't like him because like they, he treats them bad and everything. So they like want to leave. And every time they leave to a new like house, he comes there and like somehow kills them or like does something. Um, it's kind of confusing. Like it start it kind of I feel like it rushes into it, but um, I like it. It's a really it's a really so that is all of my Netflix favorites. I hope you enjoyed. Um, this was a really short video. I don't really watch a lot of Netflix, but I watch a lot of Netflix. I actually I watch a lot of Netflix. I just stick to like one show at a time because if like I'm watching different shows all at once, it's like it's too much for me. So I have to like sit down and watch a whole show first. I need more TV shows and movies. So if you can comment down below, that would be greatly appreciated. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked.
this video. I don't know what, what, what do you want me to say. <laughs> and subscribe because like I said at the beginning of the video I'm going to be posting um, twice a week now for summer vacation because I've got nothing to do. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna go now because I have to edit this. So um, I'll talk to you guys. What's today? I'll talk to you guys on Wednesday. Okay, bye! <laughs>